Hungry Wasteland, buddy. We're finally at the pit. Uh, it was one hell of a journey to get here. And we got frame rate issues. Yeah, well, we can deal with it. After all, we're recording in 1440p, right? All right, so this is Max, and he took all of our gear when the, at the end of the last one. So if we talk to him, we get... How about instead of standing around out here, you get the <laughs> fuck inside and get some work done? Yeah, that's what you get. Uh, he took all my stuff and stored it in the safe. Aha, uh -huh. he took all of your belongings. No, 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 no. The mean boss took all the dumbass slaves goodies. <laughs> Is I'm going to cry to Asher? Hmm, we're going to have to meet this Asher. He will have his. Yes, he will see his face soon enough. Okay, let's go downtown. Here we are. Ooh, here, let's turn our... Oh, it was on. All right, fine. Boy, we might want to wait until morning to start uh, exploring this area. There's our the end of the quest, and then a new one should start. Uh oh, what's going on here? Unsafe working conditions. Oh my God! What are these poor people? talk now. Well, I guess not. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god, they're dead. No! Oh. No! Oh god, that was terrible. Do they have anything to loot? Nope. Just tattered slave outfits. Wow. Uh, look at the disease on their bodies. That's terrible. That's the sickness that everyone's been talking about. Apparently the guards don't have the sickness. Well now, who's this? Hey, lady. Oh, God, she looks terrible. It's dangerous. What? Oh, it's Nola. Oh, honey, you're pretty banged up there. Yeah. I can help you out. What do you say? Yep, sounds good. Fix me up. All right, let's do this fast before the bosses notice. Mm hmm. Sorry, I had to take my Invisalign out. There we go. If you get hurt, come mm. talk to me. I can help you out. Okay, Nola. No, 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 la. No, no, no. Okay, enough of that. Uh, what do we got down here? Hmm. Some steel workers. Who's shooting at us? Oh, I think it's just, uh, sparks flying everywhere. Okay, there's the guy with the sickness. What has he got to Don't say? Hurt me. I'm not gonna hurt you. And who's this? Please, just go away. Okay, they don't like any... They don't like talking. Fine. Oh, I see what he's doing. Cutting that stuff. Let's see, can I use uh, that? I might be able to use a wrench and bang someone over the head with it. I just don't know yet. Ooh, there's a bo mailed box. Hey, what's in here? A hockey mask. Hmm. I could actually use that. I could, that's, I could use that as armor. Okay, so it's pretty obvious that we can't really do much about these guards right now. <laughs> Uh, and this is why. Uh, if you take a look, all I've got in my inventory is this pistol with a little bit of ammo. 24 rounds of it. But now I've got this hockey mask, and I can wear it if I want to. Uh, and I don't think anyone minds that I'm wearing it. Nope. Okay, let's just see what's over here really quick. Aha! Uh -huh. We'll wait until morning in a little while. I just wanted to walk around a little bit. That's the mill. I thought it said the mall at first. But it's the mill. Who's that? You seem so anxious. Hey, buddy. Hey there. Welcome to the family. Oh, gee, thanks. Uh, you're not family. Why are you so cheery? I'm not cheery, really. I've just accepted my role here. Oh. I found a book once. Medea read part of it to me. Mm hmm. It said, The master doesn't try to be powerful, he is powerful. Uh huh. An ordinary man keeps reaching for power. And thus never has enough. Oh, maybe. Uh, it depends on your point of view, I guess. What does that even mean? It means that I'd like to be free, but I'm not. And the harder I cling to that desire, the more miserable I'll be that I'm stuck here. Oh, good point. And this work is hard enough without extra misery. Uh -huh. Speaking of which, I should get back to it. Oh, sure. Okay, get up. All right. So we'll uh, check up with him later on, see how he's doing. Now, how do I get back to where I was? Yeah, there we go. All right, let's find Medea, and then we'll... Oh. 
What is this? It is. Werner sent you, didn't he? Yep. Good. He finally <laughs> found someone. It is, my dear. We can't talk out in the open like this. Meet me in my house as soon as you can. Mm. We'll talk there. Okay, her house. <sighs> now, what I could do, I could start opening fire on these uh, slavers, but that would be pretty much suicide at this point. It's not impossible, but it's extremely difficult to wipe out the raiders with just a little uh, gun that I have. Hey, baby. Not interested. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, before we go into wherever Medea's going. Oh, yeah, okay. now we're in downtown. And you'll notice uh, the scaffolding everywhere. Um, after we go and talk to Medea, the then we'll wait until morning. Working. Oh, God, what's her problem? Ooh, yuck. Oh. Yeah, what do you want? What are you doing? Oh, nothing, sure. never mind. Whatever. Let me know if you need some food. Yep, she's the chef. How'd you like it? Her handling all of your food. Oh. Uh, they eat trog, actually. It's pretty gross. Uh, the trog are those, uh... uh see a lot, don't you? Ooh, uh, you up to something? Huh? Well, I'll tell you about the trog in a minute. Actually, I don't think we're even supposed to know what the trog are yet. Okay. Let's go into Medea's house. We'll talk to her. Uh, but remember, we can loot this place first. In fact, uh, just before I recorded this, I found one stash, and I'll show it to you. Ooh, there's a, a Nuka Cola. That can help, right? That adds some hit points. Okay, here's a stash over here. There's actually several stashes. Oh, no. Poor dead slave. Yeah, I found the stash over here. And it's a lawnmower or something. Oh, engine block, right. I get purified water and dirty water. Hey, that's better than nothing, right? Uh, I don't think there was anything else over here. Oh, yeah, this leads to what we saw when we were talking to the other guy. Okay, let's go into Medea's house. See what she has up her sleeve. And this leads to what? Ooh, down to Uptown. But it requires a key, so we can't get in there yet. Okay, and to Medea's house we go. All right, hey. we can talk now, but we shouldn't take too long. Okay. They saw you come in here, so they'll come looking for you if you take too long. Mm -hmm. I have a plan for getting you into Asher's palace, mm -hmm. but we need to wait. In the meantime, you're going to have to blend in. Supposedly, Asher's palace might have the key to uh, curing this sickness. Whoa, whoa, slow down. What's going on here? I don't know what you saw on the way in, but the guards don't really take kindly to workers just standing around. Of course. You're going to need to look busy or they'll sniff you out pretty quickly. Mm. And if they get too close, you don't look like you belong here. I see. Well, whatever it is, I can handle it, I'm sure. I'm level 26, right? <laughs> so what is it? Outside of the mill, there are a bunch of old steel ingots just mm. lying around. Every so often, the foreman puts out a work order to collect them. Stealing it's, it's practically a death sentence, and they never assign it to anyone. They make us pick who's going to do it. Bastards. So she picked me, I bet. <laughs> Let me guess, the area is full of super mutants. What in God's name is a super Ooh, mutant? You know what? Never mind. Whatever they are, you're wrong. <laughs> what it is full of are trogs. Trogs. What the hell's a trog? They're what most of us hope we never become. Uh -huh. The contamination gets to everyone to some degree. For most people, it's some form of cancer. Mm -hmm. Sometimes harmless, sometimes not. For others, the contamination drives them insane. And they become trolls. If it doesn't kill them, it changes them. They uh -huh. become animals, deformed and inhuman. <laughs> it's not pretty. They're everywhere and they kill on sight. Okay, so, hey, where can I get some weapons? I can't really help you there. <laughs> Ask around. Maybe check with Marco in the mill. He's been okay. making some of our tools into weapons. Oh, that might help. You might even be able to find a gun on one of the dead bosses out in the steel yard. Mm -hmm. They... What was that? Hmm? What's, that What's is... going on in here, Medea? Mm. Who is this scam? Um, nothing. Uh, nothing, sir. I, I was just telling this new worker about the job the foreman posted. <laughs> Oh, yeah? Oh. So he's the one that's going out to the steel yard, huh? Yeah. Yes, sir. I told him what he needs to do. He, he knows. Ten ingots, as fast as he can. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> then. I hope you also said goodbye. Yeah. <laughs> All right, playtime's over. Get to work, grinders. 
Okay, we gotta get... up there in his palace and us down here in the muck. Oh, well. Um, steel ingots. Starting to sound a lot like Skyrim, eh? Stay out of my way, lady. I want to loot your desk. Let's see. Oh, she's got bottle caps. All right. Well, it never hurts to loot bottle caps, and you never know what, what else you're going to find laying around. Ooh, dirty water. Okay, that can come in handy. So can these. Remember, you have to loot. All of a sudden, loot has a new meaning in the pit again, right? Oh, there's nothing in there. Okay. Nothing in there either. Uh, you can't suck on milk. Uh, did I see another? Nope. Those were empty. Okay. So let's do it. I'll show you our quest really quick. Uh, unsafe working conditions. Yeah. So we have to go into the steel yard, collect 10 ingots, and then try to get a weapon from Marco, too. Let's go out. And let's wait until morning, actually. No, no, no. Here we are, and it's morning, and you can actually see what the hell is going on now. Uh, you see the scaffolding everywhere. There's a uh, like a whole network of bridges up there that probably leads to something interesting. Oh, look at that. It's a vault boy. <laughs> okay, let's see what's over here. Oh, skeleton. Oh, sh uh, oh, she's just standing there. Eyes front. Do you work? Why is she just standing there? What, does she want to die or something? Uh, we might well, have missed. Aren't you a tough? Yeah. Not interested. Sounds like uh, Max. Uh, I don't want anything from her. Okay, let's uh look over maybe here. Hi, how are you? Get out of my face. Oh, okay. Uh, let's see. Anything fun going? Ooh, sh they're uh, kicking slaves up there. It'd be interesting to find out how to get up there. I just can't get up there at the moment. There's that asshole again. I uh, talked to those people already. Uh, this is the mill, so we're ready. We might as well go in there now. Uh, but before we do, let's look around. Aha, uh -huh, look at that. The broken hydrant. There's your stash. So don't forget, there's another stash there. So you look around for like engine blocks, broken hydrants. That's what you're looking for. Um, let's just see if there's anything else. There, we might find one more stash. That's exactly what you would uh, be looking for, too. Just It'll just only take a second. No, no, no. We were doing this uh, at nighttime, and I couldn't see a damn thing. But now, what my... Aha! Uh -huh. No, nope, there's nothing in there. Anything in this tire pit? Nope. Okay, well, I think that was it, actually. Uh, beans? Come on, beans. Nope, that's it. Okay, there's the dead folks. Anything down here? Hey, there might be a secret stash down here. Nope. Nothing. Nothing. Oh. Well. Oh, but that, that reminds me. I'm going to miss those super mutants. <laughs> we're not going to have to... We're not even going to see them for about 40 episodes. Okay, let's go into the mill. All right. And we're almost done with this episode, but at least we can... Uh, get our bearings and look around a bit, right? Let's see if there's anything. Ooh, there is something to loot. I'm just scrap metal, actually. Yeah, I can't do much with that. Can I do anything with turpentine? I don't know, but I'll find out, right? I have plenty of room in my inventory now, so I can add anything I like. Uh, let's talk, let's find that guy that makes weapons. Hey, pit slave. Ooh, that guy's pretty hot with all that grease all over. And there's another one of those guys. These guys look fine. Like they're not, they don't have the sickness. Who's that? Another pit slave. Yeah, and pit slave. Okay, they're not much help. This also, these machines also press ammo. We just can't do it right now. We'll have to wait until later. There's those engine blocks. Anything fun up here? <laughs> nope. Okay. Let's look around. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Ooh, somebody's talking. Oh, they're planning an escape. Hmm. I, we might be able to help them escape. And it's been 15 minutes or so. Let's just end here and then we'll try to find Marco in the next video and get ourselves some weapons. So if you like this one, you can subscribe to my channel and you'll get all these Fallout 3 videos in your inbox and also Skyrim, Bioshock Infinite, and Crisis 3. 
Um, come back every day at 9 p.m. Eastern. I try to have a new video for you every day. And if you follow me on Twitter, then you'll get an alert every time I upload something. All right, click the like button too if you liked it and add a comment, please. That helps me out a lot. We'll see you next time in the pit. Thanks for watching.